Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the woman of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. Now, this video is a series of videos I'm doing on the Big Bang Theory. In my belief that the Big Bang Theory is the most ideal show on television today that really shows the evolution of these four main characters and how they go from having no women in their lives to actually having the woman of their dreams in their lives. Now, if we look at the first few episodes in season one, these four characters reveal their trepidations and their fears about approaching women, except for one, and that would be Sheldon Cooper. Sheldon Cooper is a brilliant man. In fact, he's a genius. And Sheldon doesn't have any filters between his brain and his mouth. He says pretty much so anything he wants to say. He's not concerned about being embarrassed because he feels he's the smartest man on this planet. Interesting, yes? Then there's Sheldon's roommate, Leonard Hofstetter. Leonard is absolutely smitten with Penny, the neighbor across, across the hall. And she's a very attractive young woman. Well, <clears throat> Leonard, because of his, his self-esteem is so low that he's very fearful in approaching Penny. Yet he's so smitten with her that he just has to do something and has to try to at least get Penny's attention. The one thing that Leonard has, which is amazing, he has the courage, the strength to go up to Penny and actually ask her out on a date. But when he does, if there's any, any questions on Penny's part, he gets nervous and starts fidgeting with his hands and he starts looking away and he can't look at her in the eye. And then he loses so much confidence that he can't even talk. And he starts talking about gibberish, stuff about physics and things that Penny whoosh, doesn't even understand. <sighs> then there's beautiful Howard Wallowitz. <clears throat> Howard is very excited about getting laid. And because he's designed material and equipment that's used in outer space, he thinks he's really super cool. And because he speaks seven different languages, he also thinks that women will be impressed by him. And he approaches women with confidence, cockiness, and creepiness. Rajesh Kutrapali. Let's look at Rajesh. Rajesh, born and raised in India to a wealthy family. Rajesh is so nervous and gets so fearful and so worked up and so anxious when he sees a woman, he can't even look at her. In fact, he can't even talk to her. It's as though he doesn't understand the language. Gentlemen, in the first year or the first season of Big Bang Theory, these gentlemen display this type of behavior. Yet when we fast forward to season 12, Leonard is now married to Penny. Howard Wallowitz has found the woman of his dreams, Bernadette Rostenkowski, and they're married as well. And guess what? Howard and Rajesh fixed up or set up Sheldon on an online dating site with a perfect match. And that would be Amy Farrah Fowler. And they are married as well. Lastly, Rajesh Kutharpali realized how he can start talking to women and he is dating Anu, another Indian woman, and they have a very cute relationship. Now, how did we go from these guys not being able to talk to women and Sheldon no filter on his, on his brain? Well, guys, if we fast forward to season 12, those guys, the three of them are married. Rajesh is now talking to women. So let's look about what happened, what evolution took place for these guys to come to where they were by time season 12 happens. Well, as time goes on, Leonard continues to date Penny and they have an on again, off again relationship. And mainly because Leonard doesn't know how to treat a woman. He's a nice guy, but he sometimes gives off so many different uh, intentions and he's so needy. He needs Penny in his life. She breaks up with him, I think three, maybe four times before they finally get married. And in fact, Leonard proposes three times to her and she says no all three times. Eventually he asks her, Penny, I'm not going to propose to you again. When you're ready to get married, you're ready to marry me, you propose. And it's a cute, cute episode. 
So Leonard, because he starts getting some success with Penny and eventually sleeps with Penny, he now has that success and confidence and he feels like he is a strong man who is successful and who has confidence and no longer is in fear. Howard Wallowitz, on the other hand, when he finally meets the woman of his dreams, Bernadette, well, what happens with him, he starts evolving and he starts realizing that he doesn't have to impress a woman to actually land her. He just needs to be a confident, relaxed, successful man. Rajesh Kuntrapali, who couldn't talk to women at all, what he found was if he took a little sip of some alcohol, he instantly gained confidence. And then Sheldon Cooper, yes, the filter on Sheldon Cooper's mind finally started to take hold in season 12, where he has to bite his lip, bite his tongue, do whatever to zip his mouth and not say anything. He starts actually feeling the emotions of other people. Well, guys, the difference between Sheldon Cooper and the other three characters, there's one main difference, and I want to share this with you because if you're anything like the four characters in Big Bang Theory and you're not sure how to approach women, gentlemen, there's one thing that's preventing you from doing that. It's expectations. If you have expectations on how the conversation is going to go, whether it's negative expectations or positive expectations, then you're going to get nervous. You're going to get anxious. You're going to build up that fear inside and you're not going to be able to pull it off. So gentlemen, when we lower our expectations and say, you know, I just like to meet that lady over there sitting at the bar, walk up to her and introduce yourself. Hi, my name's Patrick. You've intrigued me. I'd love to get to know a little bit more about you. Would you like to have a cup of coffee? Leave it at that. Let her say no. It's okay if she says no. Maybe she's dating somebody else already. Maybe she's not even interested. That's okay. That's not a chink in your armors, guys. We got to lower the fear by lowering our expectations. Gentlemen, I hope that this video has helped you get a little bit closer to finding the woman of your dreams. By the way, before you click off, don't forget to click on that subscribe button. There's some great content in my videos, guys, that will help you land the woman of your dreams. Thanks again for tuning in. I'll see you in the next video.